Number nine, it is time. Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Boss run could be a problem, especially if I can't get it flipped over on its back quick enough. But once I get it flipped over on its back, it's basically over. It's just the issue of you got to get it flipped pretty quick. <laughs> So if I don't get a decent starting flip, I guess I will be restarting pretty much instantly. Alright, there it is, and oh my god, it's already shooting. <laughs> what the heck? Wow, that was uh that was some delightful RNG. Then I, I couldn't find aggro for a second there. Alright, let's get on there really quick. And before I go <laughs> Before I get shot at again. Oh jeez, this is not a very good start is <laughs> okay fine whatever I don't care that much <laughs> yeah that was a, such a terrible start that yeah I was probably bound to retry that run anyway <laughs> redo with boss around don't shoot at me instantly this time please that would be very much appreciated <laughs> uh, you kinda are Woo! okay <laughs> Ah, girl. Ah, girl. Ah, girl. Where are you? Ah! <laughs> Why are you over there? Nothing is working my favor here. <laughs> Ow! Yeah, that's, uh, that's a spicy meatball there. <laughs> All you have to do is get on Ah, girl here so I can get the best chance. But, uh, it gives me a good chance to recover there. Yeah, okay. Get away. Get away. Go. Go, go, go. Oh, jeez. It's just so hard to get started on this one. That's what I was mainly worried about in playing this, but as long as the hard part is at the beginning, it should be entirely doable. In theory. <laughs> nah, it's doable. Just gotta get things just right. Okay, where is Agro? Maybe I can see... Okay, he's directly behind me in the cutscene. But, does that mean it'll be... Well... Oh, I see the blast scare Agro away from me, and yeah, um, well, well, hmm, come on, Agro. Uh, okay. <laughs> Just gotta get up and away. Oh, shoot, it's gonna shoot again. Okay, I need, I need a break. I need a break, please. Okay, there we go. <laughs> there, it's, the time is lenient enough, I guess, to, to an extent that you'll be able to kind of, sort of, mess around a bit, but not that much. I guess it's just taking into account all the RNG at the beginning here, because after that it's pretty straightforward once I'm able to get on its back. Uh, I just wanted to get flipped over by a geyser quickly, please. That would be very, very much appreciated. Hi there. Yeah, I see. You see, you see me. I'm just gonna, gonna, gonna kind of lead you over here by this geyser. And uh, I don't have to be going at maximum speed here. Oh, Nelly! <laughs> come on, come on, come on. I guess I do need to be at maximum speed when I'm away from you. I should say, when I am close enough to you, pardon me. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna try and get it to stop in place above the geyser, if at all possible, by just kind of weaving left and right here. Just trying to get it into the position until the geyser get, gets back to turn on status. Uh, wait, 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 hold on. I think we've got something going here. Uh, I'm just gonna go underneath here and see how this turns out. Uh, you're gonna flip, because you're right under the spout. Um, Uh-oh, you're gonna slam down from up above, aren't you? Yeah, that's not, uh, that's not good for me. <laughs> uh... So I'm guessing that this run is a bust as well. Oh, Bossaron. Oh, Bossaron. You can be troublesome, but oh so doable. <laughs> Alright, begin once again. <laughs> I have no other choice but to do it until I win it. And okay, so you're gonna shoot immediately every time, I guess. That's just what you do. Uh, ah, girl. Ah, girl. Ah, girl. Okay. Let's shoot. 
And dodge! Oh, I took some decent damage there. <laughs> Mistime my roll. Uh, aggro? Where are you? <laughs> oh, you're way over there. Oh, forget it. <laughs> Woohoo! Ow, oh, pain! Oh, thank you for finally coming to me. Aggro sometimes is not your best friend. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna be doing the same thing, just weaving around until I get a hopefully good geyser run here. Just a matter of getting that geyser to throw it off immediately and not just linger around just continually shooting me or slamming at the ground because that's not a victory. Yeah, you can pretty much go to any of the geysers just as long as you use the same strategy but there's probably some better geyser to go to for the sake of the way that they run. Like they might be in se a certain sequence but I'm not sure about that. Uh, you're gonna be shooting again I know. Hey, but uh, at least you see me and you're coming towards me. That's a that's a good start. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna kind of weave you back and forth here, and ow! <laughs> just calm yourself, Pika Gam. Let the water do its thing. Come on, get a little closer to that geyser there. That would be that would be most delightful. Ooh, oh, 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 Okay, tip over. Tip over. You just need to go a little bit more forward. Uh, you're doing the slammy thing, aren't you? Yeah! It's okay if I'm... as long as I'm not directly underneath them, I won't be killed by it. But I just wanted to be tipped over by the geyser. It just doesn't seem like he's nearly as close as it needs to be. Uh, no, he is not. <laughs> no. That's a killed run, too! <laughs> It's so hard to get it in place, and that's why the beginning part is the most difficult part. Well, I should say it's hard to get it in place quickly. Like, you'll eventually get it in place, but it's the thing of, you gotta get it in place quickly because of the time limit. Alright, Basaran. Shoots. There you go. Whoa! Why did you shoot there? It... I, what? <laughs> that was an awfully smart shot you just did right there. And I'm gonna sh get out of the way. Oh, jeez, what am I uh, getting hit by? This is this is disastrous. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, you gonna do another one right away? Yes, you are. Zoom. Oh, I died. <laughs> Clearly, this is not my Colossus. Oh, whoa, whoa, no, 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 retry. <laughs> Oh, 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 when things go right, they go really right, but otherwise, it's an uphill battle. <laughs> skip, 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 and yo, oh, I wanted to go on top immediately, but no, that, that failed. <laughs> ah, girl, actually, maybe I should just be focusing on going away from it, you know, like on foot, because I'm decent enough at dodging it this this way, so... Yeah, maybe I'll just do this, because it's not going to move any faster if I use aggro anyway, so... Just stick with what's consistent, I guess. Ow, took a little scratch damage there. Come on, come on, come on! Geyser, geyser, geyser! Okay, I'm going in the right direction. Keep going, keep going, keep going! Yo! Hee hee hee! I'll need aggro at some point for most consistently uh, dodge its attacks when it gets closer. Hello there. Hi there. Thank you for coming to me when I said your name. Okay, run, 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 run before it shoots. <laughs> okay. This is looking decent so far. Other than, you know, the kind of wonky start. <laughs> You're just gonna move and groove and loop around and it's gonna fire again I mean the guys is gonna fire again I know it's gonna keep firing until it flips no more projectiles please and this is another thing that you since you have to keep weaving around the projectiles it keeps keeps kind of messing with you hello there this is what I'm looking for <laughs> okay let's get the shot really quickly here Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it! Hurry, hurry, hurry! There we go! Alright, now it's gonna flip over all the way on that side. 
So now the music's gonna change and I can start my assault on its main body. Wow, that's a lot of, a lot of shaking going on there. Alright, so now I'm pretty sure I've got it. <laughs> but I'm not positive. We'll see how things go, I guess. Just need to get uppy somewhere around here. Eh, I guess this will do here too. Eh! Just need to get on the fuzz. Eh, I was trying to do probably something I shouldn't have been doing by going onto the leg. I mean, the, the tail, excuse me. Or the leg, but eh, it's fine. It's fine. Not a big deal. Now it's gonna flip around. Well, eventually it's gonna flip around, but all I need to do is get up to one of the ledges near the top, and this one is pretty much won. And come on, flip, flip. See, the thing is that it flips back when it's ready to, and it's it's really pre-timed, I guess you could say. <laughs> all right, there we go. And now I can drop down to there, and the fastest way to get up to its head is over via the back here, and then you just use this as a pathway. It's like a whole pathway straight to its head, and yeah, just gonna roll with it. Totally jeezed. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, no. No, no, no. no, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> I am not gonna lose it now. No, Siri Bobby. And this is its only weak point, by the way. So, after you get here with a decent amount of time left, it's pretty much over. Hence why I just wanted to get the good first part of the run, which I was having great difficulty with, but you know, that's that's how the game goes sometimes. I just got so used to actually having good RNG that having some uh, bad RNG just felt a little sad. A little bit sad. <laughs> I might have to recover my stamina part way through here, but eh, it's not really that big of a deal. I've made I made really good time getting on its body overall. It's just a matter of flipping it within a certain time frame, and you'll have it. It'll just keep trying to buck me, and uh, it's it's what what hey, hey, hey what oh uh, that's why it's because it was going into a different animation. Oh whatever. Uh, let's recover some stamina here. Just let go and let it do its thing. And it's gonna buck back. Oh no, it's not. It's gonna do the side shake. That's all right. Just as long as I recovered some stamina, I'm happy. And good stab. Oh yeah, that was a really good stab. And really good stab. Oh yeah. 58 seconds of victory. I'm pretty sure I got this unless something happens. But we're gonna see. I don't usually get thrown off it, so this shouldn't be a factor. I mean, that shouldn't be a factor whatsoever in the defeating of the turtle. And actually, it might be a tortoise. But anyway, I win! <laughs> Woo! Oh, yeah! Feel the pain! All the pain you've caused me in those sword strikes. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm moving that camera. Let's try and get up to a high point before I get attacked. To get a nice, nice view. Oh, I'm too late. <laughs> I was gonna say get a nice view of the area as I pass out. All right, since I defeated another two colossus, there's gonna be another item to show off here. I forgot what it was though. We're going to see, I guess. Oh yes, baby. Hmm. <laughs> loading screen. Loading screen. Oh, loading screen. <laughs> wow. By the way, there's a different light at a different spot for each of the individual items, by the way. Woohoo! Yeehaw! Oh, yeah! <laughs> I really should cut ahead after just getting back here, but I don't know. I just kind of have fun making the banter along the way. Okay, what do I get? Lizard map, maybe? That is the Shaman's Cloak. By wearing it... By wearing it... By wearing it... Thou shalt receive less injuries. Yeah, basically it makes things easier. I don't think it prevents one-hit kill attacks. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it doesn't prevent one-hit kill attacks. Especially not in the time attacks, because you can't use these special items 
in the time attacks anyway, so yeah, item, shaman's cloak. Is there really a difference in appearance? I don't think, well, maybe a little bit. Yeah, I think it's like a more purpley red type color in comparison to the other one. Let's go over to the light. This should be enough light. Uh, actually, it might be too much light. <laughs> okay, let's, let's turn it off and see what it looks like without... Yeah, that, that one's just white and then the other one's more like the, that purpley red color. So yeah, that's that's the difference in appearance, I guess, so that you can tell that you're wearing the cloak. And with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Whee!